Uh, but before we get to the uh, Wither Essence, uh, we're going to need to talk a little bit about Inferium and tearing up Inferium. Uh, there's a number of different levels of Inferium. Uh, the higher level stuff lets you craft higher level items. Let's keep an eye on the students here. Keep an eye out for any troublemaker. She is rocking out. Look at her go. She got a cassette tape. <laughs> I have, you know what? I actually had a cassette tape just like that. Uh, actually, it might have been a little bit more yellow than gray, but uh, that looks very, very familiar. What's your name? Patricia, Patricia Manny. Very nice. Nobody said anything about bringing my own lunch. Um, okay, then, uh, we have an, e an, um, an emergency lunch prepared <laughs> for an such an occasion, lunch. and, um, yeah, just, um, so yeah, there you go, that's your snack. That's my snack. Yep. M m make sure, sure you wash it before you eat it. Uh, where can I wash it? <laughs> um, in the toilets. Trust me, they're clean. We just had to rewatered. <laughs> you rewatered? You rewatered the toilets? Yeah. Just... Where is this toilet that I might wash my fruit in? <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> I, I think I think I found reason two why there are no other students in this school. <laughs> Alright, so it's gonna cut. Don't have anything I can boil. Can I boil a bug? No. Come on. There we go. Oh, do I have to do it each and every time? I thought it would be uh, automatic like the lumber station. Oh, hello Walter. No, this food's not for you. I'm sorry. Uh, I do need some wood. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on, one of you two disappear. <laughs> like, I, oh my goodness. I wonder if breaking... Oh, okay. I was going to say, I wonder if breaking uh, two blocks at a time uh, messes that up, but obviously it does not... Oh, there's a chicken. You belong in my other series. You don't belong in this one, chicken. And the Ferris Rot Knot, uh, which is the, the big... Everyone's Jackal Wolf, uh, coming back with some more Sky Factory 3 uh, pre-build in, uh, in my Sky Factory world. So it's nighttime already. Um, so I am working on my Wither Farm. Uh, I've recorded a couple of episodes uh, just a few minutes ago. Uh, well, actually, it was uh, last night, I, now that I think about it. Um, uh, and I've made myself some uh, reinforced glass, uh, which I'm going to need to use to build my wither farm. Uh, I'll be honest with you, I've never done this one before. This is a little bit, um, uh, a little bit new for me. I'm just going to make some more because uh, i got to feel I'm going to need quite a bit. Uh, I'm kind of basing the design off of, oh boy, I, I wrote it down, um, ba -ba 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 -ba. XP crafted in, uh, hypnotized, uh, wither skeleton, or wither skeleton, wither farm, uh, so they had a really nice design, it was sort of a long drop, uh, design that I thought would work really well, uh, so I'm going to start uh by making some uh wither glass and uh then uh oh, i need some more glass for that uh bah, bah, bah. well i'm in the wrong thing that's why and then i might uh swing over to my uh chicken run uh world and uh, spend a little bit of time in there hey d4 how are you doing uh thanks for uh, joining the stream uh just uh, working on my uh, wither farm, um, and then I'll probably actually work on my uh, cloche of cloches uh, as well. Um, that should be enough glass. Uh, so yeah, it's actually let's, let's sleep. It's always better to to play during the day, I guess. Everything's pretty well lit up, but um, 
I don't know. I, I think it shows up better on the screen if everything's lit up. There we go. So I've built a platform uh, over uh, over there. That's sort of going to be the base of uh, my wither farm. Uh, I did a five minute video on it. That will be. I think this one comes out on Wednesday, and then my glass comes out uh, the following Wednesday. But um, I built this nifty little uh, teleporter uh, to get me back and forth. And um, trying to think what the best way of doing this is. I've never actually built one of these before, so. Uh, it is all uh, fairly new to me. Uh, did I still have? No, I got rid of the... Let's go... Um, trying to think. I'm going to go grab... I'm going to grab the angel block again. Uh, this is how I, I built that platform. Is a, There's a nice little block in Sky Factory um, called an angel block. And... Uh, oh, I got two of them. That's right, because I tested to make it but I'll go pop back over here and it's a nice block you can just sort of place it in midair um, so that's how I built this platform here and I kind of build off of it uh, so I think I'm gonna place that there and all right so was that center did I make that center Um, I don't know. Have you uh, have you been into the uh, world of solitude uh, uh, today? To I I left you and uh, C three PO a couple of uh, I I'm going to call them gifts. They're they're not uh, they're not great. They're sort of uh, the uh, the only uh, I think I said that they're the only uh, currency I've got in game right now. Uh, uh, so uh, hopefully, hopefully you've seen them uh, or had a chance to to look at them. But uh, they are not much. But uh, I don't know. Uh, you, you guys have been you know really great so far. So I kind of kind of really wanted to do at least something. And you guys have got a really lovely base. Like uh, I was really really amazed. Uh, that ship you guys have is uh, just phenomenal. Let's see here. We're gonna place that. How many is that? Um, kind of want to make this a square. Oh wait, I should be using my building wand. And I want it to be four by four in the middle, which it is, which is good. Um, I gonna need a lot more glass, that's for sure, because I want this to go up quite a ways. Um, so while I'm waiting for uh, the Wither Essence to farm up, I might finish my Cloche Cloches as well. As well, uh, thanks. We will. We're having a break from it at the moment. Oh, that's that's fair enough. Um, uh, there is such a thing as too much Minecraft. Uh, that's for sure. Go up to three. That is. I probably actually don't need this outside, but. Um, yeah, I'm gonna need a lot more of this glass. That was uh, two stacks worth. Um, so once I get that built up, I'm gonna build the uh, wither generator up top. Ooh, oh no, that's right, because it's gonna be three wide. And then the withers are gonna form up there, drop down, and then there's gonna be a wither grinder here. Um, oh, I was about to fly back. Take my teleportation thing here. Uh, so let's go see how those um, farms have been working. I've got a lot more things I've got to build uh, in my five minute series before I get the, the wither farm done, but uh, not quite. I got a couple of stacks, so let's. Um, while I, before I forget. Uh, let's make some glass. Do I have any in here? I got quartz in there. Um, I know I've got a ton of sand uh, over here. Two, three. 
just throw these in here for now. Um, what I should do, I should get this hooked up to my refined storage. Um, I don't know, maybe we'll come back and, and do that in a little bit. Uh, so, um, oh, I should grab the glass first before I go up there. that down there don't need stone I don't think I need you and throw that up there I can't even remember what oh I think it was uh, there's a uh, water reservoir under here and I think that's what I needed the quartz for so glass don't actually have that much and I'm gonna need a lot more for the wither so what I should do all right I am, I'm gonna hook this up to my refined storage I think um, do I just want to move it let's just move it for now and Let's see, it's not going to be the nicest place to put it. Um, let's see, let's try. Is that actually powered? Yes, that's powered. So let's get that working while we're waiting. And then. I am going to need uh, I'm going to need an importer and an exporter. Would help if I could spell. All right. External storage. No, I want but This is a bit like the mech and magic uh the modded series that me and c are doing it, it is it's um a lot of similar packs in there i've uh, watched you guys uh do a couple of those and uh there's definitely stuff i recognize uh that you guys are doing um though i don't know because this has got uh the the magic in here actually give me one second here what did i grab i grabbed an importer I don't want an exporter. And, um, oh no, I was going to see, because I know the magic you guys were working on. That's Ender IO. Hmm. I thought there was, it was alchemy, was it? Um, I can't remember what it was called in your, oh, here we go. There's elk, alchemical wizardry. Um, it's something I've actually, actually, I haven't actually played around with, uh, at all. Yeah, there's the alchemy table, um, it's the blood magic of that. I've, I've seen guys do it. It's not something I've ever actually, uh, got into myself. Um, I want a piece of sand. Oh, I need some cable as well. Of that how are you guys liking the the mech and magic um, it looks like it was a really uh, it's it's a really good uh, I don't know it, is, is that another server that you guys are on is the mech and magic or is it um, I don't know is it or is it something uh, something different like is it just a uh, your own sort of world um, what have I got here? This is the exporter. So that should pull the glass out. And then I guess I didn't even need the conduit. So we'll go importer and prime that with go with sand. Uh, 
why is the progress stuck at 60%? It's got power. Debate without signal. Okay, there we go. So this should stay active all the time. Um, but I don't think this is actually pulling items. No, okay, so I did need the conduit. Because I thought I would have to bring it. Hmm. So probably gonna have to be better to go under. Uh, just go break this guy right here, and then what's my charge? Eighty-five percent. So I should be okay. Oh, I should have figured out where I'm gonna come up first. I want to say it's going to be right here. Oh, let's see. Come on. Come on. Oh, I'm just getting too far away. All right, we'll just go hold myself in place here. And uh, I think actually that might work. Alright, let's try that. Alright, you know, I meant to sleep. I don't think I actually did, did I? Or has it been a full day already? It's actually probably been a full day. Alright, so... Uh, did I do this wrong? It's importing... Sand. Oh, maybe I should have to prime it to export glass? Um, so then obviously I'm not hooked up. I think I gotta actually hook it up to that there. Um, okay, let's, we'll try that. We'll go cable. I, oh no, I grabbed all my cable already. Um, except that one. Let's see here. See doing the evil craft in it. It is good. It's a uh, server owned by uh, Sylvaski. Sylvaski? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Um, that's good. You know, I, I've getting on the um, World of Solitude server. Like it's my very, very first server. Uh, so I don't really know what to expect, but um, it is. I've watched, you know, you guys uh, do a couple of servers and I've, a couple of other people out there. I thought, wow, there's a ton of pe people out there that uh, play on the servers and uh, they seem to be having an awful lot of fun. Okay, it's not getting any power. Um, all right, I, 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 I need to rethink what I am doing here. All right, let's... This is what I get for not really planning out what I was doing. I'm just sort of, you know, doing it a little uh, off the cuff, uh, as it were. Um, what I'm trying to do is, I guess, get my glass to automate a little bit, because I'm going to need a absolute ton uh, for the Wither Farm and for my Cloche Cloches. Um, and, okay. Oh, well, I got the one. I must have lost all the other pieces. Let's put you there. Um, Silva Sky. Silva, okay, Silva Sky. That actually makes sense when you break it up like that. Uh, I should have seen it in the name, but uh, I, I did not pick up on that. Oh, I got a one right here as well. So let's we'll put you there. Got a little bit of lag. So instead we put you Oops. right there now I should be able to it's still oh it actually kept the sand in there I didn't realize that um, 
What have I got on these guys? Enhanced energy conduit. Uh, three, that should be enough. So, um, hmm. One, two, so that's made that connection there. All right, so now that is filling up and I just gotta figure out the importer and the exporter again. Um, so I guess I gotta break that. Or oh, I wonder if I had the the two mixed up. Um, all right, so that is the exporter. It should be exporting sand. Am I right? Okay, so it's exporting sand, and now I want it to import glass. Um, I moved them, that's why, right there. And all right, so okay, there we go. Now I've got it working. So it's going to be making my glass for me. Um, and kind of let that run in the background for a bit. Uh, let's. So that is good. So I'm going to have an absolute ton of glass in a bit. Actually, let's go and check. Um, should have a couple more stacks of Wither Essence now. Yeah, here we go. Oops. Two, four, six, eight. I think that should be enough to make another stack of Wither Skulls. Oh, perfect, almost perfect there. And then just make some reinforced glass. So uh, my thoughts on the Wither Dropper, uh, well, I'm going to call it the dropper portion of the Wither Farm. Uh, is it's kind of going to be that little spine thing on... Oh, it's raining. I get, didn't even notice. Um, I've got a... Um, oh, what am I doing? <laughs> There's a reason I put the teleporter in. And uh, I've got a rain... A, it's a rain stopper. I can't remember what it's called. I found it in the loot bag a while ago. Um, don't, I'm not hungry, so I don't need to eat. Holy cow, I can't even really see that glass in here. Tell you what, let's let's go. We're going to take a little nap, and then that rain should go away. Is this guy right here? Actually, it doesn't look like he's even on. Oh, rain shield. There we go. You can see it's uh, working. So it creates a uh, shield against rain in a certain block distance. I don't know off the top of my head, but it is uh, really, really handy uh, for keeping it from raining while I'm trying to record videos. So... Um, I was not uh, thinking about that when uh, I placed my uh, uh, wither farm uh, off in the distance there. All right, there we go. So, I, like I said before, I don't think I actually need that spot, but um, I'm going to put it there anyways. Get two, three, four. Was that that was it that was all all that did so um oh. so why don't we work on the closure cloches then try to maybe finish that off uh eventually i'm going to go into my chicken run world but uh obviously this is not going to be running in the background while i do that so i kind of want to spend a little bit of time here uh, oh i am hungry though Um, how much glass do I only got the 15 on me? I'll grab a little bit more. Let's see. Should be going up at a pretty good rate. I think I was down quite a bit. Um, I'll grab three stacks. It's not going to be enough either, but... Um, 
It's something I'm going to have to maybe just go AFK in here in the world at one point and uh, see how that works out. So it's pretty much straight up. That's going to be... Okay, I'm not going to hover there. Um, so it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and at least 1, four, probably 14, 15 to the top of that square. And I still got another square to do, so that's going to be an, you know, an awful lot of glass. Oh, this is not going to... Take that and place it right, right here for now. Uh, but it is two blocks before I get to build that um, input uh, thing. So, ooh, if I get rid of, how are we for light? We're okay for light here. Something I'm gonna have to keep an eye on, so to make it too high since that's what we're gonna need. Might as well do it right from the beginning and then I'm not having to uh, go around a second time. Oh, see, I'm gonna have a light problem there. Now they're not gonna spawn on the glass. Um, so as long as I don't have any light problems inside of the actual cloche, I should be okay. Let's see, like that one right there. So, oh, no, that's a lever. There, there, in my, right in my toolbar there. Come on, there we go. Didn't mean to do that. Come on, I can't jump with my. Oh, doesn't matter. I think that'll disappear anyways. Uh, so, oh, two. This should be fine. Okay, so the front is going to be here. I'm going to have to grab some of that stone again. Uh, it was the dark stone. It's very similar. Actually, it's almost... Is it exactly the same? It is. All right, so it's the exact same as what I've got out here. So I was using the chiseled stone. How's my jetpack? 63%. Uh, what have I got left over here? So I've got the chiseled stone and the cobblestone. Are these the two that I was using? Cobblestone, chiseled stone. So we're using the cobblestone as dark and then the chiseled stone as the light. Um, let's see now. That goes all the way over. I'm going to have to light that up at the top uh, somehow. Oh, I guess this would be glass on top of it, so it shouldn't make a big difference. Oh, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, four, six, eight. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, and then it is a square in the middle. Did I get that? Perfect. Look at that. Okay. Oh, and um, 
go all the way up. There we go. Uh, and then a square with a square. that and then up well, I got, I'm actually gonna have enough of this uh, it's gonna be almost uh, could be more than enough to finish that let my uh, jet stream go away it's not too bad uh, I kind of regretting this glass though I should have checked to see if there's something a little bit more uh, clear so let's go check if I put that in the middle that takes care of all of them let's go see if there's a better glass than that uh, it's not not as clear as I would like um, uh, reactor glass is fairly clear hmm I got quite clear glass. Let's see what the kind of glass we got overall. So there's glass. That's actually really clear. But it probably, I don't know what, what happens when you put it side by side. Sometimes it will disappear depending on how they've, how the, the skin's made. Um, clear glass. Enriched sand. Ooh, sand and quartz makes enriched sand. Um. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Let's. You know what? Let's make a little bit of this. Um. I want sand. And quartz. I should have a lawful lot of quartz as well. Let me see here. Oops. All right. And so enriched sand. Let's go and I suppose I could just do it right here. Just for a test, I want to kind of see uh, what happens when they get put side by side, and see if it's uh, if the the edges disappear or not. Actually, what I should do, I should go get a tool with silk touch on it. Actually, I might have one uh, in one of my chests somewhere. So, if we okay, yeah, that's exactly what I want right there. So. Let's go. I don't want to waste all that glass that I put up there. Um, and I thought I had something with silk touch on it. Um, it's not something that's ever really come up in my world uh, where I need uh, silk touch. So uh, what's this guy got? Silk touch. Perfect. Okay. So we'll head up here and we'll get a vein mine that. How much did I get? Ooh, the sun's going down though. Let's go sleep before we got any mob spawn. Come on. There we go. All right, and let's go grab these two guys here. Go eat some food, and this is actually going to go fairly slow. Let's uh, let's head over back to that alloy smelter. And um, we'll switch you out. And we want. Oh, oh right. Um, 
let's see, never active. Let's just keep that off, I think. And it is going to fill it up with sand, but that's not a problem. Um, with sand and quartz. Oh, I don't want, oh, ooh, I don't have as much quartz as I thought. Um, uh, can I not break that? Into quartz, uh, or maybe I gotta crush it. Um, ba -ba -ba. Why do I think? Where? Well, I can cast it into glass. Why did I think I could break it into back down? Quartz glass. Hmm. All right. So that is not. I know I've got a quartz chicken. Um. Let's see here. Quartz chicken. I gotta one day come in and hook all this stuff back up. Uh. To my refined storage but uh, I for the moment I've got it all sort of disconnected two three four all right so that should get me quite a bit so um, another thing I'm gonna have to do is um, make myself an automatic crafter at some point uh, so one, two, three. Actually, let's just make a bunch because I know I'm going to need a whole bunch for um, uh, which one is that? Start importing that. Oh, I got to throw this up in there. Get rid of that sand as well. Um, throw that glass in there. That's the clear. Wait, what was the other glass I had? Quite clear glass as well. I can't remember what I had. That I don't have that much of it. Um, what was the recipe for that? Um, quite clear glass. Oh, it's glass into that. Okay. Um, so let's we'll stick with this here. Oh, sorry, it's time for me to go. Getting late. I got work tomorrow. All right. Well, thanks for coming out, D4. Uh, it's always great seeing you uh, out here. Um, uh, thanks. Uh, I'll hopefully see you uh, in World of Solitude as well uh, at some time in the future. So uh, you have yourself a good night. Thanks, D4. Uh, let's see here now. Uh, I got to turn this back on. That's what I got to do. All right, so that's working there. So that's going to get me the glass I need for my cloche cloches. And let's clear this up a little bit. Um, throw that glass. Don't need you. I am going to hold on to you guys. I want to hold on to you as well. Oh, and I'm going to put that silk touch away. Uh, I may need it in the future. I probably should keep it on me, but let's go see how the, the Wither Essence is doing. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, we got a couple of stacks here. Eventually, I'm going to have to build myself some sort of auto crafter. Um, uh, something that's on the list, but uh, I just have not got around to it. Oh, I suppose I should have kept four stacks of glass. Two, three, four. Yeah, I am going to need more glass as well. Um, no, I need it there. Okay, so that's one stack. 
Let's see, what else can we... Uh, before I start working on the, the Wither Tower, or the Wither Tower, the Wither Dropper portion of the Wither Farm, um... You know, I suppose I've got to look into the actual wither killing port parts of that. Um, something I gotta gotta do a little bit more research on. Probably before, uh, probably I gotta have to watch a couple of videos because I'm not. It's been a while. Like I've been working on this piecemeal, uh, probably for almost two months now. Uh, it's probably six six or seven uh, of my five minute episodes. Uh, once a week and I've just slowly been building up you went red why did you go red something's full man storage disk is really filling up we're gonna have to add another one of those sometime in the future as well um hmm. ba -ba 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 -ba. so I wonder if I should just build another... How come you're not working? Oh, he's not pulling out clear glass, though. I do want... I think it should pull out everything, though, shouldn't it? Yeah, okay, so that's just going to pull out everything. Um, so... Got the Wither Essence up there. Oh, yeah, I don't need you either. Um, hmm. I kind of want to let this run a bit. So, let's take a look. Let's take a look at some grinders here. I think I will be switching over to my uh, Chicken Run world uh, pretty soon. It's a mob grinder. Ooh, that takes... Draconic though, hmm. mob masher. Don't think that's the one I need, anyways. But all right, I'm gonna jump out here. We're gonna jump into the chicken run world. I'm gonna work on my chicken condo for a bit. Um, uh, I'm gonna have to come in here and go AFK and let uh, me build up some resources. I probably should have done that last night, but uh, I was thinking I had a lot more glass than I actually did. So uh, let's jump on out here. And we'll jump into the chicken run. Mm. All right, hey guys. All right, so uh, what I said I was going to do, oh, there's the other copper chicken. Did I grab him? So there's one. Well, there you are. It's hiding from me over here. That's two. So. Let's. Let's just throw you guys right here for now. Because I got some building I got to get done, so. Um, well, what have I got in my inventory? Let's see. This is probably full. Oh, no, I can get a little bit in there. I'll tell you what, let's... Let's make ourselves another chest, and then we can get a little bit of... What am I doing? There we go. And, oh, I made two. I didn't mean to make two. Um, throw it down. I should have put it on the other side. It would have been a little bit easier to move. Actually, I'm going to throw that stuff up anyways. Because I don't think it's going to fill up the bottom part here. If I remember uh, when I've done this before, it will only uh, fill up the side that the... Um, uh, the conduit's going into. Although I suppose I could throw another conduit onto it, but it doesn't really seem like it's uh, that necessary. So 
There we go. So that's full there. And uh, anything I don't need here. Those two eggs I should get rid of. And that chest. Throw that there for now. I got to get a better storage system here. Um, Gunpowder and gas tier. Oh, wow. I left all this stuff up here. Uh, I need you. And I'm going to need some more chicken eventually. I'll just leave you guys here for now. Don't want to lose you. Okay. So, time to shear some sh shear some shear some sheep. Grab. I am kind of regretting dying all the different sheep. Uh, I thought it was a good idea with my uh, spectrum of supporters, uh, but it means I have trouble. If I need more of one color, I can't. I don't have as much white as I would like. Um, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, it's, how, it's sort of how I uh, set it up. Uh, where's the door here? All right. There is a. I think there is an automatic uh, sheep uh, sh shearer farm. Uh, something I've uh, only looked into a little bit. Uh, I keep meaning to take a look, uh, but could, once I get you know my chicken condo built a little bit better, I'm not actually going to need a whole lot of wool anyways. So it's you know kind of seemed like um, maybe not a necessary thing uh, but it would be kind of cool to, to build uh, you know I don't know I, it would be would be an interesting build that's for sure I just don't know if this is the world to do it in All right. nope you're staying in there okay so, um, oh, I got another blue. All right. Let's actually go take a look. Grab all this wool as well. Some white wool. Oh, there was a chisel. There we go. There's a chisel. And let's head on up. It's been a long time since I've actually worked on this chicken condo. Um, it's this is the tier two is all the the dye chickens, so it's really kind of a, a ghastly color here. But um, is that all green? I got a lot a lot of the greens. Um, I see I kind of worked myself into a, a, not a not a problem here but I've kind of put myself into a little bit of corner uh, with the design come on uh, let's grab I think it was you guys down the middle oh no that's no that's not the right one let's see here go bang that must be the one right there okay through there and actually I gotta set up the uh, conduits on some of these guys as well uh, I think we we'll continue with the blue down the middle I actually really like this uh, this particular carpet uh, not carpet but uh, chiseled wool uh, if that makes any sort of sense at all, uh, we're gonna go down like so, and then out. Um, what have I got? Oh, I got more wool in here. That's good. And that was all the stuff I needed for my conduits. So let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oh, and F7 here. Three. And I think that one right there. 
All right, so I'm going to need a little bit more blue wool. That is okay. Uh, it's green. Well, I don't have any lime green. I've only got a little bit of white. Uh, and cocoa brown. See, um, so I'm looking for, oh, I can dye stone, dark oak stone. Hmm, huh, I did not know that. Let's see, cocoa beans, brown elevator. Oh, what was that? That was block chame chameleon. Let's see, to white. Can I make wool, bone meal, wool? See, now, can I do that with any one, though? Where's my bone meal chicken? I thought I've tried this before. Um, what, we don't need a... No, see, it doesn't want to doesn't want to work that way. I didn't mean to throw that. Let's try that again in a full crafting table. No, see, there's no way for me to get this back to white, and that's why I'm kind of regretting, uh, short of dying all those chickens, but then I'd have to build a, um, uh, something different for my spectrum of supporters, so that's something I've got to thought of. Oh, hey, Moo Moo Face, how are you doing? Uh, thanks for uh, jumping in and joining the stream. Uh, I'm just working on my chicken run world. Um... I know you you've uh, you like your chickens as well, so uh, uh, so thanks thanks for coming out. Um, I'm just trying to trying to figure out a way. Like I've built a spectrum of supporters things over there with the different colored sheep for the different colored wool, but I keep running into a problem where I need more colors of wool than the you know the sheep have produced, and I, I was trying to figure out a way to uh, dye these guys back to white, and uh, I just don't think it, it's possible. So. Um, I don't know, it's, it's, it was just sort of uh, speculating whether I should dye all my sheep back to white and then build something different for my uh, spectrum of supporters, but um, I don't know, it's, it's something, something for the, something I gotta think about, I guess. Let's see, what else have I got? Grab some more green. Actually, what I need is more sheep, because I've got more colors. But you know what? Maybe what I should do... Don't... You're staying in there. I know what I need to do. I know what I need to do. So, let's grab you. And put you there. Where's my bone meal? Is that going to make you white again? Or do I gotta wait until you get wool again? Or well, maybe I can't dye sheep back. Cause I, you'd think his eyes would be changing. Uh, Ex, Ex Stream. Hey, thanks for uh, joining the stream. I, I'm not too sure if I'm pronouncing your uh, uh, your name right. Uh, Ex Stream. I know it's like extreme, but uh, you got the A in there. And so, Moo um, uh, Moo Face, uh, love chickens. Uh, you're welcome in awe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are uh, there are some cute cute chickens. Uh, that's for sure. Uh, there we go. Okay, that's what I gotta do. I just gotta. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take one of these guys. Oh, all right. I've learned my lesson. I'm gonna take one of each of these guys out, and I'm gonna dye them white, and then I've got white uh, more white wool that I can uh, use for later on. So do I have? Yeah, okay, I got tons, tons of it here. So you guys are good. Um, let's head over here. I think you got to wait till it grows the wool back. There we go. Uh, it's extreme, but a unique version of it. It is very unique. Um, there's a lot of unique names out there on the internet. Uh, but there's a lot of unique names out there in real life as well, I guess. But... Um, Let's see here. So let's place you guys and you. Oh, are you in or are you out? Let's, there we go. All right, so. All right, go grab all this white because that's what I'm going to need. 
and got to go work on my tier two of my chicken condo. Um, it's the the tier two is the the die chickens, so it is extremely. Uh, uh, I called it ghastly earlier, but it's more. Um, I don't know, garish. I think might be the right word for it. Uh, since extreme on its own is taken, I, you know what? I I, I bet it is. Uh, when I started out on the internet, uh, like you know, twenty five thirty years ago, uh, I used to use the the handle just Wolf, and then I'd you know go to a place and well Wolf was taken, so then I'd be Gray Wolf, and then I go to another place and then, you know Gray Wolf would be taken and Wolf would be taken and uh, I think I you know did uh, Lone Wolf and Silver Wolf and eventually I'd, I just stumbled on Jackal uh, Jackal Wolf and it's just it's something I've never really had a problem. Uh, getting although actually on uh, on Twitch there is a Jackal Wolf so I have to be Jackal Wolf 77 it's probably the first time I've actually run into that problem so um, I had a chest in here here we go throw that there I'm just gonna use it to put some stuff in um, let's see I'm actually gonna need a lot of this stuff okay well let's start with the lime green um actually i could probably do it in here can't i i get any nine just to, just to do the floor bits and then i gotta chisel them i gotta go oh, i oh, didn't mean to throw that actually let's throw throw that there um so that's what I wanted to do. Use up the uh, old chisel first. Actually, go five, six, seven. No, I want to not doing this right. There we go. Six and three. Um, and lime wool. Oh, did I? Is that right? Um. Oh, you know what? I didn't need this carpet here. Why did I do this wrong then? Um, hmm. These guys actually should be over by one. All right, well, let's put the carpet down first. So I want that one, and I want that one back. Put it in place. And then, oh boy, I'll be honest with you, I'm not, my favorite so far is the, um, the creeper uh, green wool, the llama carpet. Um, oh, oh hey Extreme Man, thanks for the follow. Uh, that's That surprises me every time I hear it. Uh, not a big fan of this lime wool, wool uh, legacy carpet. Oh wait, that's the legacy carpet. This is the llama carpet. Ooh, I don't know if I like that either. So <laughs> that looks like it belongs in the in the kid's bedroom uh, somewhere. But um, I'll grab you and you. We're just gonna nudge these guys over. Oh, and they're full of stuff. They're absolutely full of stuff. So we're gonna. Um, place that down and I need something to there we go there we go all right so uh, are you familiar with uh, Sky Factory 3 Extreme um, I, I'm i sure I will face you've uh, been in you've watched me in this one uh, in this world anyways uh, I know you've watched uh, some of my videos because I think you were the uh, very first person to give me a uh, chicken name for my chickens. Um, uh, I want to say it was the log chickens. Bob and Logness? Does that sound right? Um, I know it's Bob and Logness, but I, I think you were the one that actually gave me those names for them. Um, that was a long time ago. This is... <laughs> it, it doesn't seem like that long, but now when I think about it, it, it is an absolute long time. Oh, see, now this guy is set up, right? 
one, two, three. It's just guy isn't though. That is interesting. Um, oh, I gotta grab you. Oh, am I still full? All right, we'll put you back and you back and eggs and die and I have yep uh, nope that wasn't me okay um uh, so you you're not familiar with uh, the sky factory 3 then extreme or uh, you or that wasn't you that uh, uh, that watched the video before I don't know uh, yeah <laughs> I feel like I'm babbling here, so I'm just going to uh, continue on as I was. Um, let's do the Coco Brown next. we got to move him over as well. So I've kind of been using these streams to, you know, get a little bit of building done, uh, you know, in, in between my episodes. Uh, you know, just, I don't know, it just, it, it seems like a good opportunity. Um... We got white and oh, I need cocoa brown. That's what exact. That's what I need. We'll just grab a stack of it for now. And crafting table on a stick. Uh, best thing in Sky Factory Three. Actually, I only needed nine. Put that down there. And we'll go chisel that up. Oh, but still get that old chisel there. So we go five six so the llama carpet and then the legacy carpet four five six I'm just gonna move those oh boy put that in the wrong spot let's see here I actually kind of like that it looks like an argyle sweater um I don't know if I'd ever wear one, but uh, I actually kind of like that design. Um, I just want to try something here. Uh, curious what it does side by... I wish I had a fourth one. Oh! Well, that is a that would be a nice little pattern there. Something else I'm going to have to play around with uh, with these chiseled uh, blocks. Oh, it looks like I'm getting a little, little hungry. All right, so that is the browns. Um, grab you, grab you. You are just absolutely full of stuff. Can I grab? All right, I need to throw some of this colored wool in here for now because I'm not using it quite yet. I will need to come back and build some of these walls uh, up behind and um, could have to put some sort of roof on top of it. But uh, for now, let's just move you over. And same thing as before. Where did they go? There. Oh, no, they're right there. That's right. They're already in my inventory. Um, put you down. Yeah, no, that's right. That's what I wanted. And then there, and there. I'm getting absolutely just full up of stuff. Um, go like that for now. Let's. I'm gonna go throw some stuff in my um, automatic uh, composter. Um, get rid of some of the eggs and that stuff that I can. Uh, uh, compost we could put the poop and the eggs actually that was it I thought I had a little would have a little bit more throw some of the feathers in there um, I put that bone meal back I guess let's see um, there we go uh, no oh is he full up again no, he's absolutely full as well uh, one thing I keep saying in my in my uh, videos for uh, this world is uh, I I get concerned that all these these dyes get full up, but then I say to myself is like well, 
you know, when am I ever actually going to use the die? Um, beyond having the chicken in the collection, it's not, uh, it's not actually that important. So uh, I'm not actually, I should actually be concerned, but every time I go to put some, you know, leftover die away, I'm like always frustrated that, you know, I've got no space for it and I end up throwing it off the side of the world or something. Um, okay, back. Uh, what did I miss? Uh, probably not a whole lot. Um, I was just talking about... Um, actually, I, I'm not too sure when exactly you left, but uh, I w was just talking about how uh, all of these, you know, well, not that one there, but uh, all these dies are getting full up. Uh, and every time I end up with leftover die, I kind of look at it. And I'm like, oh, well, what am I going to do with it now? And then I end up throwing it off the world and feel bad. But uh, I really shouldn't because the dies don't actually mean that much. Uh, it's the chickens more than anything that I'm concerned about. But um, all right, so let's do the cyan. Oh, wait, how much wool? Five. I should have some more white chicken or white chicken wool, some more white wool over here um, let's see I, I've got to go and find a soul sand chicken I don't want to do it on the stream I kind of want to do it in an episode um, but it's I got really lucky I think with my um, oh where's the that's what I want oh, did I put you in the wrong I think I put you in the wrong pen there we go. Um, I got really lucky with the quartz chicken. I ended up finding it, you know, pretty much right after I uh, uh, made the nether portal. Um, but uh, I just have not had any sort of luck with the uh, finding the soul sand chicken. So I think I might actually have to find a, a nether fortress and hopefully they'll be, be there. But it is a little bit of... Um, I don't know, a little bit troublesome to do that, so, uh, after you asked me if I knew about Sky Factory and a chicken name, oh, okay, um, yeah, no, I, I was Moo that, uh, had, uh, previously given me a, uh, a chicken name, she was the first one to name a chicken in my world, um, but yeah, I was kind of curious if you'd, uh, watched any Sky Factory 3 or, or anything like that, um, I don't know, it's, it is my favorite mod for, for Minecraft. Um, oh, I needed the cyan. Uh, this is just like a very, very small sort of personal challenge uh, that I'm working on here. Uh, I was, I started off in my five minute world, uh, which is a world I kind of do short tutorials uh, for Sky Factory 3 on. I don't know why I was going in there. Um, and I was working on a uh, wither farm and uh my cloche of cloches and you know just there's a whole bunch of other things uh you know just uh, just scrolling through here like there's just absolute ton of stuff uh in this world that you can build or not in this world in this mod uh but I, i've kind of limited myself in this world that i'm just focused on getting all the uh the different chickens i think there's about 93 uh different chickens um Got to look at for the eggs. Uh, you can only find a couple on here. You know, uh, here's like a water chicken. Oh, oh. Uh, in, in any case, there's like an absolute ton of chickens to, to breed and that. But um, I was doing something. There we go. I know what I was doing. I know what I was doing. I wasn't doing that. I was doing this. But uh, I don't know. I I, I enjoy it. I really, really enjoy it. I gotta dye these first. I'm getting distracted. I did want. Um, I did want that. <laughs> there we go. Um, okay, it's not. There we go. That's what I want. I didn't actually mean to do 10. Um, kind of scrambling, running around. And I don't want 10 either. 5, 6. All right, let's try to do this. So I wanted six legacy or llama, and then I want three of the cyan. Why is the cyan is really yellow um, for that wool? That seems really odd. Um, 
Oh, that's not too bad of a carpet. It's very similar to the, the kids' carpet, I guess. Um, let's see here. We'll place... Oh, place that down. Uh, I don't... I, there's the cyan sort of in the middle there, but I, I wouldn't call that a cyan carpet. So your end goal is to get all 93 chickens. That Yes, that is correct. I think... As of my last episode uh, that comes, that I recorded it yesterday, it's going to come out tomorrow. Uh, I think I'm up to about 29 chickens so far. Um, this is the, these are the, they're not the tier two chickens, they're the die chickens. Um, I've got a, a big list of them. Uh, the tier one chickens are down there. Uh, the die chickens, and then I just started work on my tier two uh, chicken platform. And that's going to be a lot of the iron and um, uh, da, 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 um, yeah, some of the easier to craft chickens, I guess, or not craft to breed. Uh, the gunpowder, nickel, coal, snowball, um, glowstone, which while I'm up here, uh, is the chicken I want to feature on my next episode. Because uh, I could really use some glowstone in my world. So it was yellow and... Oh, no, but I can't. Because uh, I've got to level up. Because uh, the other part of the challenge is um, the the base chickens, the chickens that you can find or craft, all start out as level 1. Uh, I don't think I've got any level 1 chickens here. But uh, where's my quartz chickens? These guys here, I've been breeding them up a little bit. So this guy is uh, four, five, five, four, four. You can kind of see that in the middle. Don't, 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 don't. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, the Chicken Hall of Fame. Actually, that that is actually not a bad name for it. I've been calling it my chicken condo uh, for quite a while, but uh, the Chicken Hall of Fame is pretty good. Uh, you know what? doesn't matter like i said i am leveling them up so there's a six five four and a six five five um uh, that is the first chicken to uh, i guess commit suicide in my world um I, I i don't know what to say about that um six six five that's actually better so let's go with those two we'll clear that out and we'll clear that out we're going to go put these guys here. So normally what I do is uh, when I'm leveling them up uh, is once I put them the eggs in the nests, uh, I go and I take the chickens out of the pens and I put them into my chicken grinder where this guy knew he was on his way, way to... Um, uh, mainly because if, if I drop them and then I run around trying to hit them with my uh you know my aiot or whatever and uh i it, it just was so much easier just to drop them on top of a spike and uh, get it over and done with <laughs> mumu faces oh and extreme both r.i.p rest in peace um but the good news is uh they will become you know chicken in my world i do need some more uh some more chickens in here um because I am running low. I've, I've eaten an awful lot of chicken in this series. Uh, but it is the most plentiful of sources. Uh, so he's leveled up. What else, Who else? Oh, you know what? I was going to build. It's something I should have built a long time ago. And... Nope. That's not right. There's where I go, want to go here. There is a egg. Um... What was it called? It's a way of, I think it's, let's try more chickens. No, I think it's just chickens. There's a way you can use it. Here we go. Uh, chicken analyzer. Use it on chickens to determine their stats. Um, which day of the week do chickens hate most? Friday. Uh, oh, so it's just an egg and a compass, and a compass is just redstone and iron, and I have both of those uh, in chicken form, uh, so I've got quite a bit 
of them. Here's the red snow chicken right here. Oh, he's r right on top of my iron as well. Uh, so grab you. So I think this lets me... Um, did I... What was I doing wrong? I didn't do that right. I need four iron, that's why. Oh, grab that. Uh, but I think it lets me check out the chicken stats uh, while they're in, um, while they're in their their pen there, uh, in that the nesting pen. And then oh, I just need a vanilla egg, which I should have. Just from the vanilla chick. Oh, did they? Are you not laying any eggs? Why? Oh, that's. I'm kind of kind of confused there all right well I've got eggs eggs for days in there um, why I I don't know what's going on there that seems really odd like you guys got stuff um, you guys got stuff the flint chickens are all full Uh, funny story, one time I joined a stream and started a pun war in the chat. Uh, winner is person who makes the streamer laugh. Spoiler alert, I won. <laughs> well, it's... Uh, there, I, I am a big fan of a good pun, uh, so feel free to go ahead. Uh, it can be an, an egg stream uh, contest. Um, that's, that's my uh, egg pun uh, for the day there. So there is a chicken analyzer. Um, oh, I had redstone on me. So if I go, if I shift, hmm. So what was the point of this? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, uh, six. This guy here. Oh no, six, six, four, six, five, five, six, five, four. I think it was this guy here. All right. Um. Use it on chickens to determine their stats. So, do I need a chicken? Like I could just hover over a chicken to find its stats. See, it just that's a ten, ten, ten chicken. Next egg in one minute. All right, so it's it's no different really than the tooltip, but um, all right. Well, I guess guess I didn't need to to build that. Let's go. We'll put you back down there. Um, all right. So let's. I don't think I need to carry that anymore. Oh, and I'll get rid of these guys over here. Uh, eggs and eggs. Um, hmm. Actually, let's go grab some more white wool while I am down here, because I know I'm going to need some more. By the way, is Shy Sky Factory, you make a giant chest for storage. Uh, yes, uh, there is a giant chest in Sky Factory uh, 3. Um, I don't know what mod. Actually, I can double check it here. Let's see here. Um, I've never actually built one myself. But, you know, Redwood Door. I know it is possible. Colossal, it's a colossal chest. Um, chest core interface. Uncolossal chest. The most colossal of them all. Um, yeah, there's a lot of different storage uh, options. Um, I like the, uh, the storage drawers because they got the... Uh, image on them um at least early on and then i i like the the refined storage which is uh more like a digital storage system but um the colossal chests i've seen guys with just like absolute huge chests uh, and then i think you can scroll through the um, the inventory 
uh, as well. Uh, one thing the the GUI's got that I really like. I really wish. Um, well, I guess it's not such a big deal in Minecraft. You're only ever in uh, you know vanilla Minecraft. You're only ever dealing with one item. But if I double check or click on the um, on this little uh, on the search bar, I guess is, is what it is. You know, whatever I uh, write. So if I go net, it sort of highlights uh, whatever kind of comes up in that search in my inventory. So if you, if you got those big, uh, like the refined storage or the colossal chests, you can kind of scroll through and just kind of keep an eye out, uh, nether quartz. That's uh, why that one's showing up there. Um, I'm just going to turn that off. Uh, so I've got nine more wool. Let's see if, oh, you know what? I've also got to work on my transfer pipes, uh, for those guys. And uh, do I have wood on me? Not much. I'll grab a stack of wood should be more than enough. So you're going to make a ME system. A UR system. I'm not too sure what you mean uh, by a, a ME system. Or a UR system. Uh, you might have to explain that one. Uh, I'm not not 100 percent sure what uh, what you're referring to there. Oh, um, me. That's the. Um, I th actually think. I think I actually know what you're talking about now. Um, refined storage. No, I'm thinking refined storage is. I think it's its own. Uh, at yeah, I think it's its own refined storage. So I'm not. Maybe I'm not too sure what you mean by the UR. Um, but I'm kind of curious. Um, a U, an UR system. All right. So let's got all those guys. Got three. So let's just make a couple more transfer pipes. Ooh, I'm missing stone and chests. Let's make a bunch of chests here. And stone. What did I do with my stone? I've got stone slabs. I do need those for the transfer pipes. Um, now I had to make a uh, cobblestone generator. It's called an ME system. Uh, I'm trying to remember what the what it stands for then. Um, or if is it just called an ME system, uh, or is that the is that an acronym? Uh, mechanical engineering is that one second here not too sure I'm not too sure what it's I'm not too sure if we're thinking about the same thing but uh, it's a good chance it, it is eventually I do want to get a refined storage system in here which um, which, if it's the same as the ME system, then uh, yes, uh, that is what uh, what we we're work or what I'll be uh, working on. So um, I've got that. So I'm gonna have to throw that in some furnaces. Oh, my chicken should be ready as well. Oops. Get that going. I had thought I had some stone left over. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, let's see here. There we go. There's eight. Uh, I got a ton of torches in there as well. All right. Um, what was I doing? I wanted to make some transfer pipes or item conduits. Uh, that should be enough for the three that I've got up there. And I need more transfer pipes. We'll grab that. See if that's enough for now. All right. Try system. Oop. 
Gotta be in the search. Uh, there's Ender IO. Oh, huge inventory storage system. I wonder if that is this the one you're talking about? Or should I be looking for uh, at system? No, it's got to be this one here. Uh, this is not something I've actually uh, used before. Um, the one I've used the most is refined. Uh, oh, there we go. At refined storage, which has got the. Um, it's more like a computer. Uh, you got your craft, your grids, your crafting grids, your storage blocks, or your storage disks. So you got a disk drive. Um, I know if we get a little bit of time at the end, I might jump back into my uh, five-minute world uh, where I've actually got one set up. Uh, I'm a, this world. This world is a little bit more limited in what I can do, um, but uh, that in the other world, it's it's sort of whatever I am. You know, in the mood for working on is what I kind of kind of work on. So I'm just gonna loosen these guys just a touch. All right, so let's see now. Um, oh, I need to make some storage drawers. But I think that's the the good thing about um, are they not storage drawers? Where's the storage drawers up? Oh, maybe it's just drawers. That's what they are. There we go. Um, basic drawers. Is what I've been what I've been using. So, ooh, I'm out of wood already. Let's take that down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need twelve, aren't I? So let's just turn all of that into wood. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then I think it was just right in the middle. There we go. Oh. Oh right. They Oh I didn't put enough wood in there. That's that was the problem. Uh that should do me perfect there. All right, so I guess we are thinking of the same thing, and it's called an ME system. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, oop, threw that down. Did not mean to do that. Um, all right, so let's go. We're going to throw that guy there and that guy there. Two, three, four, and... Oh, well, before I do that, um, throw that up. I want to prime. That one and that one and. Did I already have some? Oh, I've already had some in my inventory. Uh, that is why. So feathers go on the bottom, poop goes on the top. And this way it keeps them from uh, uh, mixing up. It, you know, the, the right stuff will go into the right right bins. I've got sort of the, the same system worked out for all of these guys. Uh, so he is set up. Um, I'm going to actually put some labels on them as well. Come up with some more names. Um, one, two, three, four... Grab the lime and the lime chickens. Oh, wait, did I do that right? I mixed that up. Uh, cocoa beans on top, eggs on the bottom. And then get rid of those cocoa beans. Eggs on the bottom, die on the top. Um, did either you guys? No, I've kind of cleaned you out. So we put that there and that there, and then last but not least, and oh, that's right. Um,
Ooh, wait. Um, oh, wait, yeah, they're all connected in the back in their individual segments. Um, I did that just so, you know, they can share their the, the feathers and all that uh, around. So let's go like that. And actually, I should have enough to do the last one as well. I thought I might have to make some more transfer pipes. Why can I not? There we go. Get in there. All right, so grab that. There we go. So egg, dye, feathers, and poop. I, I wish I had chickens in real life uh, just so I could uh, use their... Uh, uh, chicken poop for my garden because uh, it makes a good fertilizer if you let it uh, sit for long enough uh, before you throw it into your garden. Uh, that's probably the only, well, I mean, I, you know, fresh eggs as well would be pretty good. Um, have to go do some recording, but good luck with the rest of your stream. Uh, thanks, Moo Moo Face. Uh, thanks for, uh, you know, thanks for joining me again. It, it's always great to see you on. Um, I'm hoping, are you streaming again tonight? Uh, I'm, if you are, I'm going to try to catch you as well. So, uh, extreme, if you want to make a cobble gen, just make normal vanilla cobble gen, then attach a transfer node to a transfer pipe, then a chest. Uh, you, you can do it like that. Um, they've got a, some really good, uh, cobble generators in Sky Factory as well. I've got one set over there, um, uh, that works, you know, pretty well. Uh, it's going to be automated. If you want to increase production, just add some uh interactions upgrades I, it, it's certainly another way of doing it um i ended up just using the uh, i guess that's like a compact version of the um cobblestone generator it, it, that's so sort of my obsidian generator uh i turned it off because i do want to get an obsidian chicken uh but i needed obsidian to get the obsidian chicken i needed to go to the nether and get i believe it was the nether quartz chicken uh, and the only way I can go to the nether is to get obsidian and the only way to get obsidian, you know, was to get the obsidian chicken. So it was like this big Mobius strip. So I just, I kind of broke down. I just made my own, uh, non chicken, um, uh, obsidian, uh, cobblestone. I had to make the generator for because there is no stone chicken, uh, which seems sort of like an oversight. Uh, you know, there's wood chickens and, um, you know, there's there's gunpowder chickens and gold chickens and all that. Uh, there's a, even snow chickens, uh, but there's no cobblestone chicken, which seems really, really odd. But um, in any case, uh, let's see, we are. Um, so we're pretty much done up here. Uh, what I should do. Oh, you know what? I got to do a little bit of grinding here. Let's throw some of this stuff. I gotta make some more nesting pens uh, for my tier two chickens. So we don't need you throw that stuff um, up. Uh, the nether quartz, I'm gonna put that down. Glass goes up, leave that, leave that. That is what I want. I will grab some more wool when I'm down there. But what I should do is uh we'll go turn that back to white regular white wool and let's go we're gonna go make some uh we're gonna farm up some wheat so i can make some more nesting pens i mean why do you need a stone chicken just smelt some cobble and you're good it's really useless yeah, well but there is no cobble in sky factory like there there is absolutely like i started um uh, I'll show you this piece of dirt had a tree on it and I started at the top of the tree and then, you know, I took the, the leaves from the tree and I don't have them up. Uh, there's sort of bins like that. You can turn them into dirt and you take that dirt and you can sift it and you can get uh, stones, which you can combine together to make cobblestone, uh, which you, you can break down and, you know, get other resources and stuff like that. And, uh, uh, it's a whole big process like sky factory you start out with literally a tree and you know a handful of items and that is it like it is really um it, there's absolutely nothing up here uh, even the nether is uh empty other than uh, what you build into it although there are uh nether fortresses just sort of floating in there um i'm tempted i'm really tempted to go in there looking for that soul sand chicken but i don't 
I really don't want to. Um, but yeah, like everything in this world has been crafted from that very, very first tree at that very uh, single piece of dirt. Um, you know, so it's it's one of the things I, I like about this mod is what did I end up doing? Is it's really really challenging I, I, up to a certain point like the the beginning uh game is you know very complex in what it has you do um you know to get you know, to see what like there's some guys out there that have been playing this you know absolute long time and they got these you know amazing bases um just some you know really really amazing builds and they all started from just like you know one single piece of dirt in a tree uh i don't know i just it's really it's really interesting in that you know i guess if you do you know i don't know i just it's my it's the thing i like the most about sky factory is you know just how you know how much you've got to work to get you know get past that beginning point once you get past it and you start getting your factories up um you know things start to flow a little bit better i guess um how about you make some armor and are you going to get into magical crops uh, not in this series um there is a uh, sky factory 4 is supposedly being worked on right now uh, so my plan is to at least finish the chickens in Sky Factory th 3, and then when they update the Sky Factory 4, I may do the um, uh, all the magic. Uh, well, I, I, I probably start with the basic farming stuff, and then probably work my way up to uh, the agricultural stuff with the and then the the whatever that magic is as well. Because um, I don't think I'm going to redo this series again in um in sky factory 4 uh, unless they do they majorly overhaul the chickens um if if the chickens are you know different than they are now then yeah i i totally redo this series but uh if i do another sort of challenge series it probably will be the agriculture um one as well with the all the crops and uh eventually i would have to get up into the magic crops as well hello pigman um they like to come and hang out here every now and again uh, i'm waiting for one of them to bring me a chicken but uh so far none of them has just getting a little bit of water here i was uh so obviously you play minecraft as well uh what uh mods are you playing or do you just play vanilla wow well, you it sounds like you you know your uh modded minecraft pretty well so uh what mods uh have you been playing how many have i got here let's just oh no i want you Let's see now. Fill that back up while I'm working on it. Now, this is the grindy part um, that. Uh, you know, it's very reminiscent of the beginning of uh, Sky Factory 3. Uh, you spend a lot of time, uh, you know, growing trees and cutting them down, uh, you know, just to just to grow more trees and cut them down and grow more trees and cut them down. Um, as you can see, like most of my world is made out of wood uh, because it was the easiest uh, resource uh, early on in the game. Um, but now that I'm getting some, you know, chickens that have... I don't know. There's definitely a lot more um, building materials with some of the chickens I've got now. Uh, so I have been, you know, trying to focus on, uh, you know, more complex builds, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Uh, it's it's kind of, I guess, 
hard to explain in, in a way. Um, well, I'm kind of uh, have a mix, uh, both PvP and modded. Uh, modded wise, I play Sky Factory and uh, Tekkit Legends, uh, FTW Blood and Bones. Uh, you know what? I'm not familiar with uh, Blood and Bones. Uh, what kind of uh, mod is that? Let's see how many getting close I want to get a full um, full nine stacks of wheat oh, out of water or out of water again let's see here Yeah, the, I thought I heard something there, but it's probably just the sound from the nether portal. Uh, it's calling to me to go in there, hunt for that uh, soul sand chicken. Um, I probably will go and take a peek, uh, at least, you know, right here, at, or probably right at the very end. Um, it would be interesting. Uh, if I did get it on stream, I guess it wouldn't be the end of the world. Uh, I could always uh, just take a clip from the stream, but... Uh, I certainly don't want to, I don't know, I, I, I'm debating, I'm because it's been about three episodes I've been looking for it, and uh, the closest I found was a vanilla chicken uh, just sort of hanging out on one of my platforms uh, in the nether, uh, which <laughs> really, really caught me off guard, so I've been calling him my uh, non-nether nether chicken, um, but uh, it, I don't know, it, it really made me laugh uh, when I came across him. Uh, he was just hanging out there with a bunch of uh, zombie pigmen and uh, uh, some of the imps and that. And uh, it just it was not what I was expecting to find. Uh, well, it's Minecraft modded hardcore mode. Uh, one life, you can't eat the same food. Uh, o OP mobs, etc. You know, uh, I've recently been playing the, the hardcore challenge. Uh, I didn't do it this month. Uh, I had uh, my, The beginning of the month was quite busy, so... Uh, I never got a chance to, I did one episode, uh, ended up dying right at the end and, uh, said, okay, well, uh, I just got, that's going to be it for that there for this month. But, uh, hardcore challenge is really, really difficult. Um, I haven't played one where, uh, you can only eat, uh, each, uh, food, uh, once I have, uh, watched guys do that, uh, or do something similar. I didn't realize, uh, it was called, um, uh, the blood and bones. Uh, but the one rule that uh, the challenge that uh, I've been following is that you're not actually allowed to kill any of the passive mobs. Uh, like you can fish and you could eat fish that you've fished. Uh, but now with the you know 1.13, uh, you can't go into the water and just you know start swinging your sword and killing fish. Um, and you know if you know a mob fell off, you know naturally fell off a cliff and died. Uh, or a wolf, you know, attacked a sheep or something like that. You could uh, use those resources, but um, uh, you couldn't go and kill a sheep or kill a pig or kill a cow uh, for food, uh, uh, you know, yourself. So you had to kind of rely mainly on found food and on uh, growing stuff, which is uh, quite a bit difficult. Uh, I've only done uh, two full months uh, so far, and uh, food, you know... Right off the bat, food is probably the hardest thing. It's not so bad once you get a chance to kind of place a farm, but um, I don't know it's a really interesting challenge. Uh, I suggest you know if if anybody out there you know is interested in it, uh, I think it's just search for MHC in Minecraft, and uh, it, it's run by Baker Bell uh, right now. And um, I'm trying to remember that. It's sort of it was designed by somebody whose name I can't remember, and he's still sort of involved. Uh, I want to say it's, it's Michael something. Uh, he's still sort of involved, but he uh, I think he doesn't make any uh, videos anymore. But he still comes up with the the monthly challenges and and all of that. So, um, by the way, do you know you can breed chickens to different kinds? Yeah, that's what um, I'm working on over there. Uh, did I? I never actually did grab the yellow chicken and the um, 
quartz chicken. I was, oh no, that's right, because I'm leveling up the quartz chickens. Uh, most of these chickens are leveled up, or not leveled up, they're bred chickens. Uh, some of the dyes I could have made by making the dye, but uh, I ended up, uh, you know, breeding them together with the different ones. Um, most, I think that was the, how you distinguish like the tier ones uh, versus the uh, higher level tiers is all the tier ones are, you know, found chickens. Um, or I guess chickens that can be found or oh, am I got enough almost 20 gonna have a ton of seeds here but no most of my challenge uh, so far is leveling or not leveling up the chickens is uh, breeding them uh, but that's why I want to get that quartz chicken up to level 10 uh, before I breed it with the yellow chicken because uh, then I start with a 10 10 10 um, glowstone chicken rather than have like a a six 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 and then I have to level it up as well um, I'm almost got all of the found chickens there's the soul sand chicken um, there is uh, oh there's a naked chicken which you use with the shaver uh, the fun way chick which is with the TNT uh, and the beep boop chick, which is good. I'm gonna need a silk touch because you need a grass block for it uh, But other than that, I think I've got all the found or uh, I, I wouldn't call them crafted but uh, Made in world chickens and then it's just the oh. oh That's why I gotta put this guy up there first um, And it's just really the bread chickens. I've got left I think uh, you could tame a dog and make it kill everything for you. I, I think that's um, outside of the... Uh, I don't know if it's a specific rule, but I think it would generally be um, considered against the rules. Because uh, you're still commanding the dog to go and kill the, the mob for you. Um, like I said, I've only been involved with it for about uh, two months. This would have been the third month. Uh, if I, you know, had enough time to, to get some videos out, but um, yeah, that should be it. Uh, but I, I, based on what I know from, you know, uh, being in the community, like that community, and they got a Discord server in the chat, I got a feeling uh, that would be sort of frowned upon uh, as a, a tactic. Uh, I'm sure if if you came up with a really good reason to use it once, you know, they everybody would kind of say, is it okay, I, I could see that. But, um, you know, I think in general, it wouldn't be, uh, it wouldn't be considered, um, fair play, I guess. All right. So let's make up these. I think I'm good. I think I got enough wood in here. Oh no, I'm going to need some more wood. Oh, I guess I got to manually throw them up. Um, but it is an interesting idea. Uh, like I've considered, you know, making sort of like a passive mob dropper. Uh, but the, the other thing is you've only got uh, the month to do whatever the, the challenge is. Usually it's to build in a certain spot or um, like this month it was to showcase the aquatic. Uh, but the month before that it was a tree house. We were in like a sort of a jungle biome. You had to build a tree house. Uh, the month before that um, it was hermit. So you kind of had to build a little hermit uh, house on an island. Uh, the It was right next to a mushroom uh, place. So uh, there was no wool. There was no no milk. Uh, so that was particularly uh, challenging. That was my first one. Um, I know there's a bunch of other ones out there that uh, are other challenges that were really, really difficult uh, that I've heard the uh, other people in the, the community talk about. Um, let's see. One, one, one. All right, let's grab a little bit more wood. All right, could you explain me the, uh, the rules? So I, I've explained some of them, but I probably should start from the beginning. Um, so uh, basically every month, uh, about a week before the beginning of the month, so I guess the last week of the month prior, uh, there is a uh, Baker Bell is the one who's doing it currently. Uh, but she spins a wheel and there is a particular challenge that gets picked and everybody's supposed to do the same challenge and um uh, 21 we're almost there and 
and you're given a seed. Uh, so everybody's starting in the same world. Uh, when there was uh, before 1.13 came out, uh, that was the other thing. You got to be in the current, um, uh, the the current version of Minecraft. Uh, that way, everybody's sort of on an even playing field. Uh, although the the last two months with the um, 1.13 not quite being out, uh, some people chose to play in 1.13, and some people you know played in just uh, the 1.12. But um, uh, so everybody's in the same world with the same seed, uh, with the same start, uh, and then the, if they're all trying to do the same challenge. So the rules were uh, you can die on day one because it's all in hardcore. Uh, I think sometimes structures are on, sometimes they're off. Um, you can die on day one uh, and restart, but if you die any time after that, uh, you're done for the month. Um, I did die on day one, but I was it was like the day before I was heading out on vacation for a week, and I just just didn't have time to, to finish it for this month. But um, or I didn't have time to redo the the challenge for this month. Um, I'm trying to think of some of the other rules, uh, at least it, rules that would you know be interesting to talk about. Um, if you're if you do a co-op with somebody and that person dies, uh, then you got to build them a little monument. Uh, some people build them right where they die or around where they die, um, uh, but you got to build them you know something. Uh, just as a little uh, monument uh, to where, you know, to, I don't know, a monument to, you know, where they were. Um, I don't know, I, not really making a whole lot of sense with that. Um, but if you're interested, uh, it's the MHC Minecraft Hardcore Challenge. Um, I think it's like probably the top result in that when you Google it. Uh, and like I said, look for Baker Bell and Michael, I want to say it's Michael something. Um, Javadad, uh, out there is also really involved in it as well. Um, sorry, my voice is getting really, really rough here. Uh, right now, uh, where I'm living, we've got, uh, the, I live in Canada. Uh, the province over from us has got some really, really bad forest fires and we've had nothing but smoke for the last uh you know two weeks almost uh and it's definitely been affecting my voice here so actually i'll be honest with you i'll probably gonna do about, about five more minutes and then i think i'm gonna call it uh call it a wrap but um can you use abuse dupe and glitches i'm gonna say no uh i don't know a lot of the glitches out there uh because they they seem to change every time uh oh i got the googly eyes that i haven't actually noticed that um they change, uh, I, I think the, the dupe glitches change, uh, so often that, um, I, I just, I, I've no, I've seen some a long time ago, uh, but I haven't, uh, really, oh, I gotta go one back from there, uh, seen a lot, but I'm gonna say, yeah, dupe glitches would, would definitely be out, um, I don't know if, because the other thing I was gonna say is you've got your month to do your challenge, uh, and then to keep the you know the numbers of videos consistent for everybody, uh, it's only two videos a week, uh, every Monday and Friday, uh, or in and about. Uh, so there's a video limit per month. Uh, generally, it's gonna be eight or nine, uh, depending on the length of the month, um, and that again that keeps everybody sort of even. Uh, you know, everybody's got the same amount of time. Uh, episodes are uh, one full Minecraft day. Uh, no mods, though you can use texture packs. And uh, there's an Optifine, which they let you use. And a ba Maddie's Mob? Baddie's Mob? I think it's Baddie's Mob. Uh, which, uh, it, it, it's like a coordinate program. It, it's uh, sort of like the map uh, on the top right corner of, uh, you know, the, the sky factory world. Although there is no map, it's just the coordinates for you. Uh, and you can also set, set it. So it shows you when it changes from, you know, day to day. Uh, so, you know, when, if you're underground, you know, when to, uh, start your episode and end your episode. Uh, the other thing, uh, the other interesting thing is with 1.13, um, because you, in it, because you can't kill sheep, uh, it's really, really tough. Oh, that was the other thing is you can't sleep. 
uh, you can't sleep through the night to get to the next day. So you've you've got to stay up. Uh, but with the um, I didn't did I do that right? No, it's supposed to be there. Uh, with the phantoms, uh, that's now made the the nighttime hardcore challenging uh, quite a bit more uh, challenging because uh, you know phantoms come out after your four days uh, of sleep. So or four days of not being asleep and uh, I don't know it, it's uh, it's something I'm I'm interested in. I haven't actually played with the phantoms yet uh, like I said I didn't uh, make it for this month but um, uh, extreme I know all of them <laughs> I you know what I it, it's it's something I've never really played around with uh, I have seen like I said I have seen a few videos uh, that shown them off but um, I don't know I mean it's it makes sense if I was playing on my own uh, in a survival world, uh, maybe. But um, I do pretty much all of the stuff I do now. I, I've been, you know, recording or streaming or whatever. Uh, so I, I don't know. I, I don't know if it's that's you know something I'd want to show off in a in an episode or or what. But um, I don't know. It's everybody's got their own own style of play, right? And you know. It, that's the thing. The nice thing about Minecraft is there's just so much, uh, so many different ways that you can play it, uh, that it's you know it's really open, you know, open to interpretation of what uh, what you want to do. And you know, I, I don't, I've been asked before, you know, why you know I like to play Minecraft, and that would definitely be you know probably the top thing is just you know how open ended it is uh, to just not only play styles, but to, you know, uh, you know whatever it is you want to build you know whatever it is you want to however you want to play uh, i do a lot of uh, uh play a lot of minecraft with my daughter uh you know we do a bunch of videos as well uh but sometimes we're building sometimes she really likes to to do skits uh so we spend a lot of time you know play acting in minecraft as well uh which is a, a it's not something not how i would play if i was playing by myself but when i play with her it's a lot of fun uh, do you have a Discord server? Yes, I do have a Discord server. Uh, there should be a link uh, below uh, my little, uh, just on my on my channel there. Uh, if you go to my YouTube page, there's a link there on the About page. Um, I don't know if I've got a link or the the on my Twitter page uh, to the Discord. I don't think I ran out of characters, so I left it off there. Um, but yeah, no, there's uh, there's definitely a link to a Discord page uh, on my uh, channel page here. So um, I don't do a lot of Discord. It's something like I think I've only got one person that I chat to on my page, but I, I'm definitely interested in other people joining. Uh, it is a really cool little chat function. Uh, I've recently joined a uh, multiplayer server, uh, and I know we can use the, the chat function in that. Uh, as well so um it is six o'clock i want to move my chickens up uh ooh, quartz chickens i want to start moving my tier two chickens up i think i might i said it was going to be about five minutes i think i'm going to take another 10 here uh and start getting the tier two chickens up so string glowstone and gunpowder goes up i don't have uh ooh, uh there we go uh, what do I, I want my nesting my nets the whole whole goal was to to get up to that level two uh, today uh, in the stream uh, which I'm kind of glad I did so I can kind of start moving these guys up and out of the way uh, out of my breeding area it's sort of been like a storage area slash breeding area um, but I kind of want to start moving these guys up Let's see here. Um, all right, so there's one. I might actually, I'll probably come back and organize them a little bit better. Um, I don't know. I, I don't really have an order. They're sort of as I've uh, made them, but um, I don't know. It, it, again, there's a lot of stuff I got to think about on how I want to uh, change this up. Uh, quartz has got to stay down here because they are leveling up. Uh, these are like six, six something. Uh, so what else have we got? You guys are coal chickens. 
you guys belong up there as well. I actually feel like I made a fair bit of progress. Oh, you know what? I said I was going to go to the nether. I was going to give it one shot. Um, so before I close this down, I'm going to throw these coal chickens up. Uh, I will clean this up a little bit later. Um, but I do want to take that one, one visit to the nether, see if I get lucky. I got anything. I got a little bit of important stuff on me. Um, I'm looking forward to getting uh, ender pearls so I can uh, make some elevators instead of the stairs. Um, not that it's going to help me when I got my condos kind of wrapped around my um, uh, my chicken area, my nesting area. <laughs> a kitty's uh, climbed up on top of the chicken cut. Uh, I had uh, somebody named the the cow ki uh, kitty. Actually, it was Blissful Kitty uh, named the cow kitty. So. Uh, Kitty's standing up there on the um, the hen house. Uh, I don't. I can't even remember what it's called. Uh, it collects items from the from the ground for you. Um, no demons. Kill it with fire. No demons. Kill it with fire. I'm not too sure what you're talking about there. Um, or you're talking about the cow, or throw that up. I gotta get rid of these seeds. That's something I wish uh, is that if seeds were compostable. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, my throat is getting getting bad. Actually, I got another place for those. Actually, I'll just throw that up in there. I will keep the wand. <coughs> Holy cow! Um, just in case I want to, well, I guess I'm not going in there for very long, but I will grab a little bit of cobblestone. All right, let's give this a shot. What an odd name for a cow. I, like I said, it was, uh, I've kind of thrown it out there to all my, uh, uh anybody who watches the video, if there's a particular chicken that they want to name, um, no, the chicken 666. There was a chicken 666? Oh, the demon chicken. That, you know what? That is true. There is uh, the demon chicken. I um, can't remember what it's called. Uh, corrupted chicken, which uh, they're not even sure if it's possible to get. So uh, that might be the one chicken that I uh, am not able to get. Uh, Alright, let's just take a peek out here. Oh, this is the back door. Um, don't see anything up top. Let's see here, close that door. Oh, and there's a ghast already. I've already died. Died once in here. I don't want to die again. Oh, 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 Look at that. Oh, boy. Oh, there's two there. Uh, oh, there's three, four. Oh, wait, I put him down. Did I put him down? There we go. Okay, I got one. I got one. Where is... Oh, no, 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 no. Well, that's the way to end an episode. Um, oh boy, uh, that is the way to end an episode. Uh, the good thing is I've got those guys. Are you gonna attack me? Are we gonna have a problem? I got a feeling he's gonna attack me, isn't he? Uh, oh boy, that happened. Something similar happened. Uh, early on uh, where I hit a fireball back at a gas or from a gas and I ended up hitting the pig uh, zombie pigmen and they all went crazy and killed me um, but I should be lucky oh you guys are okay right, um, okay so these guys are still mad uh, I'm gonna have to wait for that to cool down oh and you guys are mad Okay, so 
<laughs> rest in peace. All right, so I think I'm going to call it uh, an end to the stream here. Uh, you know, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, Extreme, it was great talking with you. Um, it was nice. Uh, are you sure you want to quit title screen? I'm going to have to go back and get that, but uh, it is good because it will make a good episode. I can actually show that on my next, uh, next Chicken Run episode, but uh, thanks for coming out. Um, uh, do slash game keep rule keep inventory true i again that's uh, that's you know on the cheat level um i do get my gravestone uh so i'm not that worried about losing my any stuff uh that what happened with the ghast uh is when i set off the zombie pigmen i forgot that i didn't have a jetpack on from my other world and i ended up jumping off the edge and ended up falling down uh, into the uh into the nether there but um but yeah no uh if you enjoyed this video you check me out on youtube um you know you've already subscribed uh, anybody else uh, out there watching uh, please like and subscribe uh i've got mentioned i've got a discord channel and uh twitter uh, as at jackal wolf um and i'll see you guys next time all right goodbye